Krishna speaks about uh, uh, the Palashruti of this Bhagavad Gita. Whomever hears this conversation which has taken between us, I promise that they have worshipped me by means of knowledge and they will get free from all kinds of sin and they will attain spiritual world. In this way, uh, Krishna ends his uh, talk of this Bhagavad Gita. Then he sees Arjuna. What is his reply? And Arjuna says, Ashto moho spriti labdva tat prasadat maya chuta sitas sitos me gata sandeha karishye vachanam tava. Krishna, now my illusion is destroyed. I have gained my memory by, by means of your mercy. No more doubts. And I will do as you have said. So in the beginning, Krishna said, Karpanya dojo bhakata suva prachamitma dharma sammuda chetaha this is the question started by Arjuna. Now he is he's answering. Yes, whatever doubts I had previously, I am, now I am clean. Now I am ready to do as you have said. Actually, I had all this thing. But my memory was lost. Now I have regained my memory. And this is all because of your mercy. And I don't have any more doubts. I don't, uh, I don't doubt you as an ordinary human being. I, I remember that you are the supreme person. And you, are, you are with me and you are asking me to fight. Definitely I will fight. So Karishya Vachanamta. This is the understanding of Bhagavad Gita. That we should understand Krishna as the supreme person. And we simply follow his instruction. That is the ultimate understanding of Bhagavad Gita. So Arjuna ends here and then Sanjaya speaks last five verses. He says that Ityaham Vasudevasya Parthasya Chamahatmanaha Sambadam Imam Asarpsam Adbudam Roma Harshanam. He says this, uh, this discussion, whatever happened between Vasudeva and Partha, uh, it is so amazing, it is so, so astonishing. As soon as I remember this conversation, my hairs stand on end. So here Sanjaya says that he remembers. It is not that he sees, he remembers all this conversation. He has he has seen this uh, conversation in the war field, in the Kurukshetra, and then he comes back to Dhritarashtra. When Dhritarashtra asks this question, now he is remembering everything, he is recollecting and he is saying everything. Sutavan, Yeta, Gukhyam, Maham, Param, Yogam, Yoga, Ishwarat, Krishna, Sakshad, Katayata, Swayam. By mercy of Vyasadeva, I have heard the secret of Bhakti Yoga, which reveals the Supreme Lord directly from Krishna, the control of all being, who is friendly to all living entity, while he spoke, while he personally spoke it. You see, he says, it is all in the, in the past tense. He said, I have heard this. When Krishna was speaking, I heard this personally. How? Because of Vyasa Prasad. Vyasa Deva gave me this special mercy to hear this. I think looks, it looks like in, in Kurukshetra where not everyone was listening. So only by Vyasa Deva's mercy, Sanchaya could listen everything and he could relate everything. Then he says, Rajan Samsmritya Samsmritya Samvadam Midam Adbutam Keshavarjuna Yoho Punyam Rishyami Cha Muhu Muhu He says, Oh, my dear king, when I remember this again and again, the conversation which is happening, my, my hairs are standing on the end. Then he says, Tacha samspritya samspritya rupam tat adbudam harehe ismayome maharajan rishya amita funaf punaha. And also, what a kind of darshan it was. My God, I saw that Vishwarupa. Who can see that Vishwarupa? So beautiful Vishwarupa was. When I see... I am filled with wonder. My hair stand on end. Yatra Yogeshwara Krishna, Yatra Yoga, Yatra Partho Dhanurdhanaha, Yatra Shri Vijayar Bhutir, Dhruvani Tir Matir Mama. And he says, wherever there is a Krishna, the controller, the friend of all living beings, wherever there is Arjuna, the holder of bow, there will be unfailing prosperity, victory, ever-increasing wealth and righteousness. This is my conviction. So, Dhritarashtra, give up the false hope that your sons will win. Wherever there is Krishna, there is Arjuna, then definitely they are going to win. So one should not worry that this scripture is favoring war. This scripture is meant to teach us the highest bhakti yoga, that, man, that is manmana bhakto, and also sarva dharma and parityaja, ja, ityadi shlokas. And, uh, uh, and also it teaches us the various dharma 
varna ashrama and how we should perform our dharma staying in our varna ashrama and also it teaches us that there are many methods to reach the lord but the easiest method or the quickest method is direct surrender that is prapatti that is sharanagati to the lord so in this bhagavad gita uh, which is which is the essence of all the upanishad krishna has painstakingly taken all the essence from all the upanishad is given us in a very simple way so uh, 